This is lovely, okay? It's called Crazy in Love, and I guarantee you, you will have your man crazy in love with you. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jasmine, and I am a lifestyle and beauty content creator on Instagram, TikTok, and on YouTube. I talk a lot about fragrances, I do some hauls, some luxury hauls, and things like that. So if that's something you're interested in, go ahead and subscribe. And today I want to go ahead and talk about date night. Not only do you want to look good for date night, but you also want to smell good for date night. You want to leave a lasting impression with your fragrance. So I want to go ahead and share my top fragrances for date night. Whether you're going on a date with someone new or if you're going on a date with your boyfriend, fiance or husband and you still want to make a lasting impression, here are some fragrances that I would personally wear and ones that I would recommend. So if this is something you're looking for, stay tuned. Now the first fragrance on my list is talked about a lot in the fragrance community and it is Delina Exclusive. Now again, it's talked about a lot for a reason because this is just the ultimate it girl fragrance and this is also the perfect fragrance for date night. So let's go ahead and get into the fragrance notes. So for the top notes we have lychee, pear, and bergamot. For the middle notes we have Turkish rose, oud, and incense. And then for the base notes we have vanilla, amber, and woody notes. So to me this is definitely one of your feminine fragrances. It definitely is powdery to me. Um, so if you don't like powdery fragrances I wouldn't get the exclusive version. Um, Delina is a lot different than Delina exclusive but to me this is a very powdery rosy vanilla fragrance i love the vanilla dry down on this and this is definitely a compliment getter lena exclusive is definitely one of those fragrances that smell like money it's luxurious it's sexy it's feminine it's definitely unforgettable so if you want to make a lasting impression delina exclusive is it it's definitely a head turner and to me it just exudes femininity it definitely is one of those fragrances that you need to wear during date night i actually wore this over the weekend combined with with Exalté by Fumi Monet and these two together I don't know why I didn't combine these sooner but these two together are amazing again I went out with a friend and she complimented me right when I got out of my car and I would even say that these two would be great for a date night I definitely would wear this when I go out with my husband so again this is Exalté by Fumi Monet which I also would recommend for date night now this fragrance <sighs> you definitely get a lot of that orange blossom and vanilla. This is such a pretty fragrance. Funi Monet is actually a content creator on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube as well and this is one of her fragrances and this is stunning. Stunning. It smells luxurious. It has rose in it. Again, it has that orange blossom and vanilla. Oh, this is intoxicating. So right now she only has this in a travel size. The bigger bottles did sell out the first time this released and I regret not getting a bigger bottle of this because oh my gosh this just is it just smells so good guys. And when I combine these two together it is the most luxurious the most sensual, the most seductive combo there is. I, I don't know, these two. I mean, you'll be good with having Delina Exclusive alone, but if you wanna go ahead and grab these two together, you're making a statement, okay? This is going to get you compliments for sure. I mean, these are both good fragrances alone. Um, you could wear Exalté and be fine. You can wear Delina Exclusive and be fine, but these two together, this is the bomb combo, okay? I'm definitely going to be using this for date night. So these are two fragrances that I do recommend. Again, Delina Exclusive and then Exalté by Fumi Monet. For my second fragrance, it needs no introduction. If you've watched my latest videos, I talk about this fragrance a lot. And I'll be honest, I would give up my whole fragrance collection and have this alone. That's how much I love this. And it is Guidance by Amouage. Yes, I talk about it all the time. There's a reason for that. This, honey, listen, <laughs> listen. If this is your first date, okay, and you want to make a lasting impression, guidance, guidance, okay? Guidance will do that for you. Now, again, Fragrance is subjective. Not everybody will like this as much as I do, and that's fine. That's okay. But for me, this is sexy and luxurious. You know, that's a compliment that someone gave me when I wore this one time. She said, you smell so luxurious when I wore this. And 
It is screaming luxury, it's sexy, it's screaming, I'm here, I've arrived, I'm your date for the night. You're making a statement with your bomb outfit, but you're also making a statement with this perfume. It is, I don't know, throw away my whole collection, okay? I'll have this and wear this for the rest of my life. That's how much I love it. So for the fragrance notes, we have pear, hazelnut, and alibanum, rose, saffron, vanilla, sandalwood. You know, this is actually made by the same perfumer as Delina Exclusif, which is why I love them both. It is such a sexy fragrance. You will get compliments on this. It's one of those fragrances that you actually have to try yourself. I would not say that this is a safe blind buy. I would go ahead and get a tester of this because this is unique. I don't have a fragrance like this in my collection like it, and I've never smelled anything like it. You get that saffron, a lot of that vanilla and sandalwood. I love the dry down and it lasts lasts forever so if you're going on a date you know and you guys are going out for drinks maybe later on and it's going to be like an all-night event or something like that this will last you i swear from like afternoon to night you won't have to touch up this will last you all night long it's very strong and it's just sexy i, I just i don't know if you haven't tried guidance go ahead and try it i just i don't know i, I just can't explain it it has my heart and I just love Guidance so much. So yeah, that's Guidance by Emma Wash. The next fragrance on my list for date night kind of says it all in the name and it is called Crazy in Love by Montal. Now I actually have like the travel size version and I definitely am going to get a bigger bottle because this is such a stunning fragrance. Here's the bottle. I got this when I purchased Arabian's Tonka. So it came with like a travel size and this has lasted me for quite a while. So for the top notes of this fragrance, we have Wild Rose and Violet. For the middle notes, we have Saffron and Brown Sugar. And then for the base notes, we have Amber and Vanilla Bean. So this is a spicy brown sugar vanilla combo. So if you can think of that, it's spicy, but not a bad spicy. You get a lot of that saffron, but in the dry down, you get a lot of that brown sugar and vanilla and mm, it is just so delicious. Now, I'm not a big gourmand lover. I personally don't like to smell like cake or heavy syrupy vanilla, but this is a good balance. You have that brown sugar, you have that vanilla, but it balances really well with that rose and that saffron in it. And this is lovely, okay? It's called Crazy in Love, and I guarantee you, you will have your man crazy in love with you, okay? Because this smells amazing. I would even say that if you like Arabian Sanka by Montal, these two are cousins. They smell fairly similar. The only difference is this has a lot of saffron. It has, you know, that violet and that rose in it, whereas this has like a lot of that oud and vanilla, but these are similar. Like if you were to combine these, these would be great as well. You could even wear this for date night. But if you like Arabian Sanka, I would say that you would like Crazy in Love as well. It does last quite a bit. I won't say it's super long lasting. I would say maybe it lasts about four to six hours on the skin. So depending on how long your date night is, that may be good or bad for you. But this is a stunning fragrance. I'm definitely going to be getting a bigger bottle of this because I can't go without this in my collection. I would definitely wear this on date night with my husband and it is just such a sexy, warm and sensual fragrance that you have to have for date night. Next recommendation I have for a date night fragrance is Valentino's Donna Buena Roma Intense. And here is the bottle. It's super stunning. And as you can see, I've been wearing this quite a bit. So for the top notes, we have bourbon, vanilla and amber. For the middle note, we have Jasmine, and then for the base note, we have Benzoin. Now, I know a lot of people talk about the original Valentino Donna Born in Roma, and personally, I don't like the original. There's something about it that I just don't like. I, I really can't put my finger on it. It's just not for me, but this intense version, I don't know. This intense version to me is a lot better. It just smells a lot better. I think I really love the vanilla and the Benzoin in it. It's a warm vanilla amber deep fragrance can't really explain it if you like donna born aroma the original version i would go ahead and say you'd like this if you haven't tried either of them definitely go ahead and test these i believe you can get this at like sephora or elta or macy's one of those and i'll put it in the description box for you guys but this is sensual now this is very heavy on the jasmine and again if you watch my last videos i am not a big jasmine lover but this made me fall in love with jasmine it takes some getting used to if you love jasmine great 
you know, you're gonna love this fragrance, but this is heavy on the jasmine. Of course, you do get a lot of that vanilla and amber at the top, but it's not sugary, it's not sweet. It's a very grown and sexy, deep vanilla. It's a deep amber. And then you get that jasmine, and then you get that benzoin at the bottom. This fragrance is definitely grown and sexy, and to me, it screams confident. I'm confident, I'm here. I look good, I smell good, I love my outfit, I love my fragrance. Like you have to really be confident to wear this and it is just stunning. This is one of those fragrances that can be worn all year round but I can definitely see this being worn a lot for me for date night in the winter because of how warm that vanilla is, that benzoin and that amber. It is very seductive. My husband loves it on me and he actually has the cologne version of this. Now the cologne version if you're married or if you have a fiance or a boyfriend whatever and you want to match the male version is stunning it's incredible i love it on my husband okay he even got complimented on it at work okay i love that fragrance on him so the intense version for men smells amazing too just as much as this so this is valentino's donna born aroma intense it is amazing and i love this fragrance so go ahead and check this out if you haven't so for my next fragrance, this is not going to be everybody's cup of tea. This is not a safe blind buy, but this fragrance, if you learn to love it, is unstoppable. And it is Oud Satin Mood X-Ray by Maison Francis Kirk Dijon. And here is the bottle, definitely stunning. So for the notes in this fragrance, we have Damask Rose, Turkish Rose, we have Oud, Vanilla, Violet, Amber, Cinnamon, and Geranium. Now you have to love oud to appreciate this fragrance because this is a oud bomb it also is very heavy on the violet so it does make it a little bit powdery this is definitely a powdery fragrance but if you can learn to love it baby you have to be confident to wear this okay this smells like money this smells luxurious you only need one spray of this honestly one spray will last you the whole night because if you overdo it with this fragrance you are going to choke people out and you don't want to do that you don't want to choke your date out for the first time okay so one spray of this will do this is just stunning and not only just for date night but for any special occasion again one spray will do it because this is the extra version so i know that they have oud satin mood the eau de parfum and then they have the extra so the extra is a lot stronger than the original and i believe that they do have different notes um i'm not too sure about the original i don't have that pulled up but this is a bomb it is confidence in a bottle it is luxury in a bottle if you want to smell like money if you want to smell like that girl, if you want to smell confident, if you want to smell sexy, all of the things, extravagant, you came in your best outfit, you came wearing your best shoes, Oud Satin Mood is it. Now again, not a safe blind buy. It is not everybody's favorite, okay? Not everyone's going to like it because it is just very different. It's very particular. Not everybody will appreciate this. And you just have to have a love for oud, you have to have a love for violet, you have to have a love for powdery fragrances. For me, this was love at first sniff. When I sampled this, my eyes rolled back. Okay, I love it. So again, this is oud satin mood extra, and this is one of my favorite fragrances for date night. Now, since we are talking about MFK, and if you want a fragrance that is more subtle, not as heavy as some of these perfumes that I've mentioned, because these are more on the heavy side, if you want something light and airy, mean yes i'm talking about her okay i know people think she's overrated but she is overrated i guess for a reason but baccarat rouge is also a good fragrance for date night for the top notes you have saffron and jasmine for the middle notes you have amber wood and ambergris and then for the base notes you have fir resin and cedar this is a stunning fragrance it's good for date night and any special occasion really like you will definitely make a statement with this i know a lot of people go nose blind to it and so do i like when i wear it i feel like i can't smell it but other people do smell it on me and i can smell it on my clothes as well but this is a good good fragrance for date night so it's very sweet it's very woody it's very airy and very light so if you don't want anything too heavy you just want something you know a little subtle you still want to smell nice nothing too heavy and when i mean heavy like you don't want it to be like too overpowering then this would be for you it's baccarat rouge 
and you can call her overhyped you can call her whatever you want but this is going to be a fragrance that i continue to wear on date night for special occasions for every day i'm going to continue to buy more bottles of this because it to me is just a fragrance you have to have in your collection so if you want something like an airy if you want something sweet and not overpowering you don't want to overdo it but you want to make an impression Baccarat Rouge 540 is your girl. I love this fragrance. I will wear this fragrance every day if I could, and I would probably, but this is just a stunning fragrance. So again, perfume is subjective. So if you haven't tried this, I'll go ahead and leave a link down in the description box below for you to get a sample. And I just love how sweet and woody this fragrance is. This is definitely good for date night. That is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Go ahead and let me know what fragrances you've tried from the ones I have just recommended or go ahead and share which fragrances you would wear for date night because you know I'm always looking for fragrances to add to my collection. I'll go ahead to leave the links down below so if you never tried any of these fragrances and you want to go ahead and get your hands on a sample I will have that listed for you. And yeah that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you guys in the next one.